Okay, Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. So, now we will be discussing um, composition on functions as a continuation from our last video. So, we will be using the same given. Okay, but the only thing uh, we must remember when it comes to composition on functions is that um, for me, uh, I call this nested function, meaning um, I will plant my function on another function. Okay, and it's written like this um, f circle g of x okay or you can simply write uh, write this on as f of g of x so you will notice meron na tayong multiple na functions okay so what happens here so what happens here is just simply whatever is the value of the next letter okay whatever is the value of the next letter you will put it inside the previous letter yan so first, uh, to, to, for us to understand, let's take a look. The first letter is G. Okay? And what is the value of G? Let's try to box the value of G. Yeah. This one. It's x squared minus 2x plus 5. And now let's take a look at F. F is just simply x plus 1. So what happens here is, sinabi ko nga, whatever is inside here or the last letter, you will put it inside the first letter. The first letter. So take a look at the given. In our f okay f of x is just simply x plus 1 and what i said is you put it inside it simply means that all the values of x in our f will be replaced by this one so meaning what would happen there would be our f of g of x would be simply equals to parenthesis x squared minus 2x plus 5, this is supposed to be your x, plus, plus, 1, and 1. So, this is your f of x. And, but, this is your g of x. You will put it inside. It's that simple. So, therefore, in this case, this would be your answer. Yeah. Okay? You put it inside. Okay? So, uh, maybe let's uh, have another example. So, no, no, no. We should have an, another example so that you may get it better. Okay, so let me undo these things. Say I have... Um, say I have g of i of x. Yeah. G of i of x. What is inside? i. So meaning I need to put this inside g. So let me write down g. The g is x squared minus 2x plus 5. And... According to what I said before, all the values of i, okay, will be placed inside all the values of x here. Or let's uh, reverse it. All the x's here will have the value of i. And our i is 3x minus 4. So I will have parenthesis 3x minus 4, same, squared, minus 2 times 3x minus 4. Same, yeah. Minus 2, yeah. Minus 2. Plus 5. So, what happened to the x's here? What happened to the x's here would be it is replaced by the value of i. And the value of i is 3x minus 4. Okay? So, let's have another example. I think the best example is we if we are trying to use g. Okay? So let's have another example. Say I have... Um, g of h of x if we have g of h of x g of h of x our g is of course um the same meron tayong um, x squared minus 2x plus 5 let me um extend this a little bit minus 2x plus 5 yan all the x's here will be replaced by what yung nandun sa loob which is h we have 2x cubed minus 3 so, we will have 2x cubed minus 3. We have squared. Minus 2 times 2x cubed minus 3 plus 5. That's it. You will just simply put the functions inside on another function. Yun lang. So, maybe let's have something um, different. Say I have um, f of x is equals to um, x squared minus 3 and our g of x is equals to um, 2x cubed plus 3x plus 5 over 3x squared. Yan. So again, 
if we will have g of f of x, what would happen? Okay, what would happen? Let's write f of x as red. Yeah. Ah, violet na lang. Violet siya, okay? So, meaning, this would be 2, parenthesis, x squared minus 3. Up, oh, sorry. Gawin na natin uh, violet yung parenthesis natin. So, we have x squared minus 3, and then, of course, we will have cube. Plus 3, hindi magbabago, yung mga constants or our the independent variables we will have another x squared minus 3 and then we have plus 5 all over we will have 3 and we will have our last x being x squared minus 3 and again we have squared so you will notice guys that the f would be ito Yan. this would be all of your f's and what would happen to ano, to the other parts? Well, like, for example, 2 cubed plus 3 plus 5 and 3 and 2 here. Okay, they would be retained. So, what would happen? What happened here? All the x's are just simply changed. Yun lang pinapalitan natin. Okay? And maybe let's uh, do it the other way around. Say we have f of g of x. Okay? So, in this case, let's write this down in violet. So, we will have... 2x cubed plus 3x plus 5 over 3x squared, parenthesis. Take note, ah, ito yung f. So, yung x niya, ito. We will have squared minus t. So, what happened? Only the x in f changed. And it changed to what? The value of your g. Okay? So, I think that would be all when it comes to our um, given on composition of functions or if I may say it's a nested functions so if you would have any other questions you can view the video again to have an idea on what happens here um, or ask me in our class so that would be all thank you everyone for listening and assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh